Today we're here to talk about a very serious mental disorder known as schizophrenia. Schizophrenia is a psychotic disorder characterized by loss of contact with the environment, by noticeable deterioration in the level of functioning in everyday life, and by disintegration of personality expressed as a disorder of feeling, thought, or perceptions. It can be seen as delusions and as hallucinations. Schizophrenia is a serious disorder, oftentimes genetic. Schizophrenia is in over 2 million people in the United States alone. Schizophrenia occurs in all societies, regardless of race, gender, culture, or religion. Schizophrenia is a serious disorder of the mind, but it is also highly treatable with the appropriate amount of investment and research. This disease typically begins in early adulthood between the ages of 15 and 25. Unfortunately, schizophrenia has only received a small fraction of medical funding for research. The leading theory of why people get schizophrenia is a result of the genetic makeup as well as environmental problems. There are over 15 medications for schizophrenia and many new and improving psychosocial treatments and therapies. Schizophrenia ranks among the top 10 causes of disability in developed countries around the world. Mental illness can be a very uncomfortable topic, so we tend to shy away from it because we fear the unknown. The only exposure I've had with mental illness is what I've seen on TV or in the movies, and Hollywood has a very negative portrayal of mental illness, schizophrenia in particular. Think Norman Bates in the popular film Psycho. We need to start educating people about mental illness in order to eliminate these damaging stereotypes. The sooner we eliminate the negative stigma attached to mental illness, the sooner we begin to embrace one another's differences and show compassion. People living with schizophrenia today, 6% are homeless, 6% incarcerated, 5% are in hospitals, 10% in nursing homes, 25% are living independently, and 20% are living with support from friends and family. The less people know about something, the more they fear it. Increasing the public's knowledge of schizophrenia can reduce the stigma and help educate those in the community who may then be able to notice signs of trouble and help those who have undiagnosed schizophrenia seek treatment sooner. For more information, you can visit the National Institute of Mental Health website. It's a myth that people diagnosed with schizophrenia cannot be helped. Because the causes of schizophrenia are unknown, Treatment options for schizophrenia focus on alleviating symptoms. Effective treatment for schizophrenia is regularly taking prescribed antipsychotic medication and also following up with psychosocial treatment, such as counseling, family education, and attending self-help groups. Because every person with schizophrenia is different, it's hard to know what the outcome of a diagnosis of schizophrenia will be. There is currently no cure for schizophrenia, but that's not a reason to give up hope. With treatment, many people with schizophrenia can lead a relatively normal life. According to WebMD, your outcome can be determined by how well you functioned in society before you were diagnosed and how quickly you were diagnosed with schizophrenia. If you functioned well in society before you were diagnosed, and if you were diagnosed quickly, you could have a better outcome. Help Starts Here also says that 25% of people with schizophrenia are able to recover completely, and 50% of people with schizophrenia see improvement over 10 years. This means that 75% of people with schizophrenia can see an improvement in their symptoms. Although you may not recover completely, with treatment, you can still have an improvement over time. The most important thing to remember is to never give up hope. After 10 years of living with schizophrenia, 25% completely recover, 25% are relatively independent, 25% improve with support, 10% are hospitalized, and 15% are dead. In most cases, the 15% that are dead are dead because of suicide. Please help us spread the awareness of schizophrenia so that we can help those in need.